Hello YouTube. This is Mark Woods with another video. And we're back for the first demo of the custom box. First of all, let me give you guys a look at it. Let y'all see how it's looking in the back. I had it doing a lot of tests this morning. This it's testing it with different songs. And yes, it likes the uh it likes to 28 hertz to 35 hertz, which is no surprise. But there y'all go, there y'all go. A lot of more space too. So I'm actually thinking about doing something up here. I might have to go ahead and put another battery over there with a bigger battery. I mean, we still got a lot of work to do. We're gonna get a good look at it flexing. It's real solid though, it's real solid. We're gonna see how it does against this hard bass song we're about to play. You know what I'm saying? I had to switch my uh battery, my uh amp connections up too. You know what I'm saying? Just to you know what I'm saying, just to get more power to the amp. But the amp doing pretty good, it's getting 14.3. And you want, you want uh, your amp to have more more power as possible for it can perform the best way it could. So again, I want to uh, give shots out to Gorilla Hearse for making the box. You know they're sponsored by Gorilla Sounds. Yeah, and that's it, man. Like me and him, you know, we both been at the edge of our seats just to see how this box sounds. And you know, we both been communicating back and forth, you know. Now this just to let y'all know, the last box I had played lower better. This one plays higher better. And it also plays lower good, but it don't play as low as better as the last box does. Hope I'm on hope I got y'all understanding on that. You know what I'm saying? The DCs are made for you know 37 hertz. That's the sweet spot. So we figured 35 hertz would do it just fine. So we should be going between, you know, maybe 28 hertz. to like maybe 45 to 48 hertz in this box. That's what I've been getting through my experience so far from it. But it's only been a day, though. It's only been a day. I still got a little bit more work to do with it and a little bit more testing, though. But for right now, you know what I'm saying? So good so far. Is it bumping way harder than my last box? I'm going to have to be honest with y'all. No. But it's got better sounding bass than the last box. You know, the last box bumped hard too. You know what I'm saying? It's just the DCs. You know what I'm saying? It ain't nothing you can do to outperform them in the same box though. But like I said, it's, I can probably say I ain't gained like maybe 2 to 3 dBs. And that's... That's pretty much a good start right there. Like anytime you do a project and you gain DBs, that's a positive. So let's check this out. Let's check this out. You know, if you guys are new, you know, consider subscribing. We got a goal here. We're trying to get to a thousand, you know, by the end of November, you know, and that's a little time. That's a little, lot of time, you know, but right now it's like a slow time far as like, you know, car audio go because most places are going to be getting cold you know like where i'm at i'm about to get like about 50 inches to 100 inches of snow you know what i'm saying so a lot of places going to be getting cold so car audio is just not as popular right now so that's why i'm like saying you know maybe by the end of november shoot maybe way before that you know what i'm saying or maybe by the end of december you know what i'm saying i think we're going to get there with no problem though to be honest with you so let's go ahead and check it out, y'all. Let's go ahead and check it out. This one I did for my uh for my amp video when I first got the amp. You know what I'm saying? And this song do remind me of you guys, you know what I'm saying? Cause that's the way I feel, man. Like I don't know what I'd do without you guys, to be honest with you. You know what I'm saying? You guys make you know, make me keep going, make me keep downloading content. 
make me have something positive to look forward to. You know what I'm saying? So I just don't know where my song went though. We gotta find my song. There we go. There we go. And this is recommended by my bass brother Ryan Basshead. Ryan Basshead for life. And we still doing this song, but this song sounds great. So let's go. Let's do another one. Let's do another one. Actually, that sounded great. That sounded great. And like I said, we're getting more quality from the bass. We not getting more bass. We getting quality bass. That's what we are looking for. You know what I'm saying? We're looking for more of a quality bass than you know a hard beating bass. But it's beating hard though, as you can see. Trying to see if we can find something. Let's do this one. Let's do this one. 
Like I said, we'll get to the bottom of more songs with it. You know, right now, I don't know exactly what it plays great. But it's it been playing, like I said, so good so far with it. You know what I'm saying? It's right now, you know what I'm saying? Like, I had the other box for so long that I'm used to a different type of sound right now. So, it's going to take some getting used to. And then also, it's still beating very hard. You know what I'm saying? So, it ain't no... Ain't like I lost anything, you know what I'm saying? So, if you guys, you guys were right, you know what I'm saying? Getting a custom box does make a difference, you know what I'm saying? But it makes a difference more in quality and, you know what I'm saying, more and give you more, you know, punch too. So, I hope I covered everything with it so far, you know what I'm saying? I will cover more with it, you know? So, if you guys are new, you should consider subscribing. If you like the video, smash the like button. This is Mark Woods. I'm out.